Good morning, everyone. It's Pastor Tim Hammy, First Assembly of God in Burlington, Kansas. <clears throat> How are you doing this morning? I'm going to invite some people into my <clears throat> group. And uh... <clears throat> good morning, Beth. And uh, hope everybody's doing okay. And so it's winter, so it's all good. So, <clears throat> good morning, Dad or Mom. Oh, I just... So, here's the verse today. Nahum 1-7. I haven't used that book for a long time. It says, The Lord is good, uh, a stronghold in the day of trouble. He knows those who take refuge in him. I was reading that this morning. I was like, oh, that's a good verse. The Lord, a stronghold in the day of trouble. Number one, the Lord is good. Uh, we, we take prayer requests in church and, and um, we, we are just so excited when someone says, ah, oh, God is good. Or, you know, and we use that, and it's just exciting to hear. But then the second part of this verse, the stronghold in the day of trouble. I love that. You think about that, a stronghold in the day of trouble. He's, he's a strength. When you're going through situations, when you go through problems, when you go through issues, when you go through whatever it may be, God's there. And, and the very part, last part of it, he takes, he knows who of those who take refuge in him. The Bible, there was these cities of refuge that people could go and, and hide and take a, a place in to um, uh, hunker down. And I think it's, it's important to re realize that these three points, these three parts to this passage of scripture this morning is is important to us is that number one the lord is good for us right he is he is good he is he is important he is strong he is he is our strong tower and the second thing is stronghold in the in the day of trouble he is our strength he's also the refuge that we can run to he's our hiding place he's our protector and uh I think those are the things we really need to take hold of in our lives. Um, no matter what's going on in our lives, is that, number one, just to realize he's good. He's our strength and he's our refuge. Just to get through whatever circumstance. Um, so many times we forget or we figure we can do it on our own or we can, you know, well, basically, we figure we could do it on our own. And then when we either mess it up or we just realize, hey, we can't do it on our own, we finally go to God. Why don't we just move the middleman out, which is us, and say, we're just going to go to God. It's easier just to do that. So um, just a thought this morning, a short thought. Um, so get out your notebook. Quick, right? So there's my notebook. Nahum 1-7. Read out this verse, the Lord is good, a stronghold in the day of trouble. He knows those who take refuge in him. So take refuge in him in, in your day of trouble. So, so today is the last day of, of, um, of uh, devotions this week. So... Um, enjoy your weekend. If you live in Coffee County, come join us for a service um, this Sunday. We have a missionary this Sunday, Christy Alexander, who is a missionary to kids, missionary kids. So join us for that. Um, it's going to be fun. Um, it's at 1030, corner of 9th and Yuba here in Burlington, Kansas. So it's just, just exciting. I'm just excited. 
if you don't live in Coffee County, join us. Join me back again on Monday morning at 6 a.m. for another week of devotionals. So, God is good, right? Lord is good. Amen. So let's pray. Lord, I thank you so much for today. I praise you for all that is happening. I pray that, Lord, for the unspoken, Lord God, um, that you just work in uh, the things, the unspoken. I pray for healing, if there's healing, uh, finances, if there's finances, Lord, whatever the unspoken are, Lord, you know what they are. I pray that you intervene. I also pray, Lord Jesus, for... Um, us as we move through this day lord may we be a blessing to those that we come in contact with and lord i thank you for those and lord i pray that you give us the opportunity to share the gospel with somebody today lord in your name amen have an awesome morning love you guys we'll see you hopefully sunday if i don't see you sunday i'll see you next monday have an awesome day love you guys